Good morning, hope everyone is doing well, and hope you're having a wonderful week so far. And uh, here we are for our morning blast of inspiration as we blow the shofar. So yesterday I was texting somebody about this shofar blowing that we're doing every morning. And um, of course, I'm too lazy to type into my phone, so what did I do? I talked text. I talked to text into my phone. And in my phone, when I talked to text, when I said the word shofar, what do you think came up? <laughs> the, a chauffeur is what came up on the screen, a chauffeur. And I said, wow, what a funny thought. I said, there's got to be a connection between a chauffeur and a chauffeur. And I was thinking, there's a concept in Judaism of Ein Od Milvado. There's a concept in Judaism that nothing can happen without God allowing it to happen. Nothing in this world takes place unless God allows it to happen and wants it to happen. For whatever reason it is. Sometimes we get to know the reason, sometimes we don't get to know the reason. Sometimes we know the reason in the moment, and sometimes we don't. But the idea is that God is the chauffeur. God is the chauffeur. God is the one that guides everything. God is the one that's driving the vehicle and takes us where we need to go. That's how it works. That's what's going on with the chauffeur and the chauffeur. So let's stop to think about this. God is always there. He's always there for us. It's like a father or a parent to a child, right? God is that parent. We say about God, he's a vino. We say he's our parent. He's our father. He's our parent. And what about that parent? The parent is what wants what's best for their child. The parent is always there for their child no matter what. And that's this idea. So when we blow the shofar, we can think about the idea of God being the chauffeur. Whatever's going on in our lives, we need to stop it, to think about it, and to recognize that it's happening for a reason. And we need to make sure we connect with those moments. So let's go ahead and keep that in mind. So even those tough moments, God is the one that's allowing that to happen for a reason. And therefore, we need to go ahead and try to connect to those moments. And the idea we've talked about a lot is thrive, not just survive. So if we recognize that God is the chauffeur, then we will be able to thrive those moments and come out from different experiences in life so much stronger. So let's keep that in mind about this beautiful love relationship that we have with God. He's our chauffeur. He's our driver. He's our parent that's always there for us and always guiding things along the way. So let's keep that in mind and have an awesome day. Let's blow the chauffeur. Let's enjoy the chauffeur ride, the ride that we have inside the limo of life. Have a great day.